Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I have a very special review for you. This is from the OFD uh, channel, Aaron Dunlop channel. Uh, this is one of his personal watches. Uh, he dropped it off to me. Um, this is a uh, Borealis, uh, I believe it is called the uh, Sea Storm, okay? And it comes in a real nice leather case here. I really like this. Look at that, it's embossed in there. Got the little Borealis, and looks cool. Very nice. So let's open it up. Oh, look at that. You got a warranty card in here, it looks like. But uh, this watch here, this thing is beautiful. I really love the, the dial layout on this. Um, look at that thing. Ooh, I love it. It's just uh, stunning. When you look at this thing, it's just stunning. It has that uh, Blanc Pond um, style you know, layout here uh, on their old divers. Um, but that is just, oh my God, it's gorgeous. Wow. Okay, guys, let's go over this thing. So this is a Borealis um, automatic, of course. It uses a NH35 automatic movement, Seiko movement. You have the date aperture, aperture at the four o'clock. And... Um, we have a real nice suite there. Look at that. I love how it's just the the hour markers and out and the hands are all white like that. It just looks real clean. Um, that white on black just looks real clean and easy to pick up real fast. Um, you have a you have a uh, black bezel with sapphire crystal over it, and then you have of course um, these um, on your. Uh, counter here, 15, 30, and 45. This is all uh, loomed, okay, underneath. And then of course the hour markers, hands, that's all loomed as well. Um, but that's a really nice touch, I like that. I had a Seamaster that was the same way, an old 60s Seamaster, and I like it when they put it on the actual bezel like that, very, very cool. Um, this one here is a 41 millimeter across. So not a too, not too big of a watch. I was wearing this yesterday and it's very comfortable to wear. This one has a, a 20 mil uh, lug opening. Okay, so 20 millimeter bracelet, uh, NATO straps. This one's a nice rubber strap, whatever you want to put on there that's 20 mil. So that's very popular. That's easy to find, you can get them anywhere. 20 mil, 22, you're going to be able to find that just about anywhere. Um, and some really good selections out there on watch straps like Blue Shark or even uh, Barton. Um, it's got good loom. Um, I'm not going to go through the loom. I'm sure you guys have probably seen this before. Um, double dome sapphire crystal. It's uh, 48 mil lug to lug and 41 across like we were talking. Um, 14 millimeter thick, guys. So kind of thick, kind of chunky. But you know what? The way it sits on your wrist, it's really not uncomfortable at all. Um, the bezel action on this thing, I like. Look how it's lined up. You can tell it, it lines up real nicely. Watch this. And I believe, yeah, it's 120 click. And that's just buttery smooth. I mean, look, feel that. Well, you can't feel it, but you can hear it. Very crisp when it lines up on every marker. That's just really nice bezel. And, you know, for the price of these, I'm not sure. I think they're around $300, somewhere right around there. I'll put their website in the description. But... Um, well worth it guys well worth it i'm going to put a link to that to amazon as well to where you can purchase this watch or many other like it um amazon is where you can get some really good deals on watches guys so check them out um look at that sweep i just love the black and white i mean most of my dive watches are all black and white except for my omega c master i just like black and white it's it's a nice contrast, um, easy to read. Um, I just love that. It looks good. <clears throat> but if you look, you got brushed, brush sides, even the bezels brushed. I like that. Nice attention to detail there. Um, you don't really have, you have a, it's brushed on top, but then on the corner, on the corners here, it's polished and then polished along the side and then down there. So that's actually a really nice touch. Looks like it's brushed on the inside there. I like that. Screw down crown, of course, and it's signed. And you can hear it, it whines.
lines as well. And it hacks, of course. In H35 is a, it's a great movement, great Seiko movement to work with. Um, everyone mods them out, does certain things to them. There are many different watches. Um, real nice here on the case back. Borealis, watch company, 300 meter water resistance, Japan, NH35 automatic movement, screw down crown. I'm sure this is 316 steel. This is high quality guys, made really, really well. Signed buckle. That. So yeah, there you have it guys. So this is a beautiful watch, another beautiful watch. Anyways, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.